For which type of investment, J or K, is the annual rate of return greater? Well, statement number one tells us that investment J returns $115 on a $1,000 investment, and K returns $300 on a $250, $2,500 investment. So for each one of these, we could figure out the annual rate of interest. This is very important though. We're not actually going to do that calculation. That would be a mistake on data sufficiency. We don't have to actually perform the calculation. It's enough to know that we could perform the calculation and therefore these statements are sufficient. Now forget entirely about statement number one. Statement number two tells us that K has an annual rate of return of 12%. Holy shnikes, I'd love to know the bank where I could get an annual rate of 12% in this economy. But anyway, tells us about type K, but statement number two tells us nothing about J. And so we have no way to compare J and K if we have no information about J. So statement number two by itself is insufficient. When one is sufficient and two is insufficient, the answer is A.